some have already projected men of being the possible month of disbursement. Some have already projected men of being the possible month of disbursement. We are going again in circles. Mr. Onge Olivia again have projected May. We are true with Salah. We are true with with ending of the week. We are true with ending of the month. April has gone now. They have sent their full soldiers again to start projecting May for us. When will this end? After they will tell us we should be calm, that when we react, the disbursement procedures will be will be truncated. Now they have projected May. They have sent their foot soldiers to project May. Let's listen. Now let's look at the indices. Wedging from the address of the country director in the last meeting a few days ago. Uh, the country director gave everyone a clue of you see, he doesn't come out to say a specific date. They send their full soldiers to speculate dates round after they will come and debug. Let the beneficiaries rise and let there be press conference so that we will even know our left from our right. Why are they telling us no press conference? Now, why are you protecting the government if the government releases money? Let the masses tell them to wake up and give us the money. Everybody is suffering. Everybody is anticipating and you are telling us to keep quiet. Don't let the calabash, the snake in the calabash break. Let bamper in the government. If the government are with this money, let the pre press conference be done. Let the government know that people are not happy. You are protecting the government and and you are... Anyway, let's just listen. Let's what just listen. What should be expected in days ahead? He provided facts that we should wedge and build our expectation on. Actually, he addressed the four basic concepts everyone should hold very closely at the mind at the moment. One, those NGOs that were not cleared, he assured them that if they are not cleared because they have 10 NGOs onboarded in one BVM, he assured them of going to clear only one of it. That is quite a This clearing of NGOs, I, 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 I'm into ICT, I'm into ICT. What are they trying to say? United States sent $900 billion to 200 and something million citizens in not up to two minutes. In not up to two minutes. It wasn't even up to two minutes. It's, uh, it's one minute and something seconds. So why are you telling us cleared and not cleared? This is a database proceedings. Within two minutes, you fish out those that are not there. Then you tell them this is what the database said. Bring out new new logins. So why are they telling, doing us as if this is what people paid for? People paid money for apps so that they will get special people. It was even this on Jolivia of a man that said that they got people from China to, to, to troubleshoot the, the app and people from China are working with the, the logistics department of uh, UAAG to make sure that this disbursement goes smoothly. He said that three months ago. Now they are projecting me and telling us, anyway, let's listen. Important to these NGOs that were not clear, but some people are seeing this as being unimportant concepts to be addressed in the meeting. Don't forget that they have 1,000 subscribers in that NGO that is not clear. So if they doesn't receive this disbursement, it means those 1,000 beneficiaries are shut out, are frustrated, are denied this chance of benefiting from these grants like you too. So it's important that he look at the plight of those NGOs and get them cleared for disbursement. How many years will it take them to be cleared? This is what we talk, this is what it should be done in seconds. How many years will it take them to be cleared? These people are just giving us excuses. Now, why we decided to do this is because a lot of people have been led astray. Our, our point here is to get the beneficiaries informed. And that is why Prince and Co, I'm not really happy with them. They are pushing for press conference, but they are not pushing 
you, and that is why the only money they have is 700k they will go to the prince will go to warrior and sit down see see how ken is working and his people they are filtrating everywhere with their foot soldiers spreading rumors prince and the admin will go and sit down and be shouting press conference there is no free lunch anywhere if you want press conference you have to work for it you have to work for it i'm extending hand for prince and admin for us to work together for this press conference they are shouting money 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 everything is not money disseminating information is power is power they are shouting money 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 see ken and co they have a lot of platforms they incite their foot soldiers to spread rumor and make the, the beneficiaries to, to 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 have fake information which platform are these people infiltrating so that we'll have good information that is why we are here we are not deterred we want to give out the authentic information because a lot of rumor and fake information is flying around it's flying around money is good but uh, information is power information is power they are shouting contribute for 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 press conference contribute for press press conference which platform have they brought out to disseminate information whatsapp group whatsapp group yes they should go broader than that See, see, Ken and Co. They, they are, they are, they are everywhere spreading information with their foot soldiers. I was extending hand to Prince and Co. Let us walk hand in hand and disseminate information. Let the masses have the correct information. They are adamant. Sitting down, shouting for money, money. Yes, money is good, but you do what you can do at where you are with what you have. He only address those NGOs that are planning to divert or truncate this grant to themselves alone. It's important that he restate that fact. To now, these NGOs that are, are planning to, 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 to go away with the grant, have they disbursed? We cross the bridge. When we get to the bridge, you have not disbursed. They are already putting it in the mind of people that they want to take the money and run away. Even if it's an allegation, you are saying that people are accusing you, people are accusing you, people are calling you names, you are now calling people names that you don't want to disburse because some NGOs wants to run away with the money. Then you create a platform to checkmate that menace. Oh, no, no, a lot of things are going wrong. I need you to safeguard the fact that you, the beneficiary, will be disbursed to and we pray the issue, set up adequate structures to not just verbally make this address, but provide physical and tangible structure to checkmate these excesses to ensure all the subscribers receive this grant. Then again, the factor of the MOU. He says the MOU is coming on any moment from now in the app. Although he did not state the specific date, but why signing the MOU? What's the use when you say you are not with money? Have you seen how people, how there is no timetable? Everything has a timetable. When you are about to enter school, you've already projected when you are going to finish school, even if it's eight years. Even when you have a lot of carryover, you've already projected when you are going to finish. When a woman is pregnant, they have projected when she's going to give birth. Any course you want to undertake, the 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 the, the pass out age, the pass out time is projected. If you have a license, the expiring date is already stated. So why are they not giving us the disbursement time frame? What the MOU will sign? Then why are you signing MOU when you are telling us you are not with the money? Pastor Biwango actually said, don't expect the country director to come out and tell you disbursement is today or tomorrow. Because why? What is his duty if he doesn't have timetable? If he does not have plan? If you don't know, okay. For example, most of them are in Abuja staying in a hotel. Which time frame would they continue to pay for hotel? You stay in a hotel for two years, three years, four years, and you are telling us that these people are joking with us. It is an authority expecting a directive from another superior authority. 
if he stay at the telegram groups and give you a date that he has not been given by the superior authority that is interpreted as insubordination and you know the penalty for that in an administrative balance so we'll come back again to give you more updates let's keep our fingers crossed let's be hopeful that uh, <laughs> in due time they've given us may they've sent their full soldiers to give us may let's see what may comes out with see you on the other side